Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back. Uh, we're gonna do the Sea Emperor uh, reviews and see how they are. The natural 5 stars, so let's see what they have in store for us. This is an attack monster. He looks pretty awesome. So let's see if he's awesome. Attacks the enemy, dealing damage and transferring a weak effect on you to the enemy. Oh! <laughs> so basically if you get like defense break, you can transfer it over to the other one. Pretty awesome. Pretty, pretty cool. Uh, um, Skill. Now I just wonder if you deal the damage first and then transfer the weakening effect, uh, like it says, or that it's like if you can actually do the damage after the weakening effect is on him. But I believe you first deal the damage. Spear of Devastation. Uh, attacks an enemy target two times, removing its beneficial effects and turning their skill cooldown on kills on ghoul time. Awesome. That's pretty good. That's really pretty good because you can beat like Perna, you can just destroy it with this. Or um, Zyros, you could just take away his big. Yeah, that's pretty interesting. Attacks the enemy several times with, a burn with burning meteors. Okay. Each strike has 25 cents to stun. I wonder how many times is several times. Several times could be three, could be seven, could be one, uh, two, I mean. And you get accuracy. Well, the fire one is not that bad. I, I think it's a good unit. A good utilized DPS unit. I would build those. I, to be honest, I'm not 100% sure how I would build these guys, but I think the fire one I would build either on Rage Blade to make it hit really big or a little bit more tanky with Violent maybe. Um, because he has some utility to his. Same attack. It's an HP monster, so let's see what he... He has good attack power, though. Decent, sorry. For an HP monster, he has good. Attacks all enemy with a mighty wave, preventing them from using skill cooldowns. Awesome. Sweeping waves, I like it. It's basically just... You cannot do shit for one turn. That's pretty good. Attacks all enemies, decreasing their attack power by 75% each. And slung them... Oh, wow. This is a good skill. Willstorm, especially for PvE. Uh, dragons, this is amazing. I would, if you get that, it's a good dragon monster. I like him. I would build him tanky. Um, and maybe speedy. Today, Taunt. He looks pretty beastly. It's a defense monster. Let's see if you get something with defense then. Same as the water war. And attacks all enemies with a gigantic tsunami, decreasing their attack bar by 25% and removing all beneficial effects. I must say, that's not bad. You could build him as a tank and make him like remove all their uh, beneficial effects and attack bars. Pretty good. I would build him on violent. Because then he can just sweeping waves and, and mega tsunami, you can do that more often. I don't think those. Uh, I think those uh, sea emperors can make a big impact on the game. The light one. It's a support monster. Attacks an enemy. Yep, we saw that before. Yep, we saw that before as well. Sanctuary removes all harmful effects on an ally target and also grants the ally target immunity and invincible for one turn. If it's just one ally, I don't really think it's that great. And he gets speed. Well, the light one is not. Nobody's gonna get it, but it's also not that amazing. What the fuck? Mana 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 mana. It's an attack monster. It has good attack, that's for sure. Attacks enemy two times, pretty good. I think this one is a beast when it comes to attacking them. Attacks deal 50% damage. Increase damage on enemies. Oh, also the attack will deal 50% damage that do not have any beneficial effects. Basically if you debuff the whole team and you attack them on a defense rank, this unit is going to hit like a truck. So, and he has a crit rate as above, which is pretty good. Rage play all the way, definitely. I like this guy, it's a really a one shot unit. I like the, the new units, I do. I really like the mermaids, most of the mermaids. Um, why am I getting attacked constantly? God damn it. 
Well, since we are enjoying the, the new monsters, we can just try and see if we can get one, right? Depending... Oh, shit. Depending if I got room and shit. Yeah, I think I'm, uh, I'm, I'm gonna try to get some more crystals and then summon uh, or buy a pack and see if we can get some summon. What the heck? Did I just get a tech? Oh, wait. These were old. I got a successful on you. His name is almost the same as the Dark Emperor, Sea Emperor. Uh, but yeah, I hope you guys liked the reviews. Um, I didn't really go in depth, I just went over the skills and uh, just give my own opinion on them. I uh, didn't want to make too long videos on them because they're new monsters, they're cool. But uh, as long as you don't have them uh, and I haven't seen them in action, I can't really tell you what rune setup would be awesome on them. Maybe some are really good uh, on with different setups than I think right now. But uh, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed and uh, maybe we'll see some in action soon on YouTube. Well, who knows? Who knows? Maybe one of our, our YouTubers will get one and put them into action. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys later. Bye.